YouTube channel. Today we're on Roblox Studio and I'm going to be showing you how to create a rope. Now this is different from a beam because I'm going to go ahead and show you. We'll create a rope here. What you're going to want to do is just create two parts and you actually can insert oh didn't mean to right click there. Create the rope. Click on whichever parts you want. And as you can see, the rope is a little bit different from the beam because if you move them too close, as you can see, it sags. But if you pull as you pull them farther away, it's just like a real rope. It gets tighter and tighter and tighter. So let's go ahead and uh, bring this up here. We'll go ahead and anchor this block. Let's play. And as you can see, it has added in one part onto the little swing there. But let's say if you actually wanted to make a full swing, you could delete this part, just delete everything that we've added, and add in one part up here, anchor it. And what you do is actually add in a seat. Oh. Add in a seat. Move it over here. And I'm going to actually bring it up off the ground too. And this one's going to be unanchored. And what you could do. Uh oh, it's actually not close at all. I want it to be kind of closer to the ground, that way that I can actually swing on it. Alright, come on over here to create rope. Add in your piece here. Add in your piece here. Create another rope. Add in your piece here. Add in your piece here. Now whenever you play, you can swing on there. Now it does fall backwards, but that's Oofaroonie. I'm not going to get too much into that right now. That has to do with body vector, and you could actually add in, uh, like, let's see if, well, no, if you anchor the seat, it's not going to work. But there you go. That's how rope works. If you didn't you know, actually want to swing on there, but oof a rooney. Oof a rooney. Maybe you guys could add some kind of obby or something. Leave a like, leave a comment, and subscribe for more.